first pitch what is hit right field. This is going to win it. Let's just see how far it goes. And wow. it is gone. That's a grand slam home run to walk this thing off. Matt Olson does not wait around. He hits one into the seats. And it's a 7 to 3 final in extra innings. Oh, my goodness. What is what is going on in 2020? <laughs> The shed at second playing behind Smith is the tying run. Martinez short lead at first. He swings and lines one down the right field line for a base hit. All the way to the corner. Rounding third is Smith. He scores the tying run. Martinez to third being waved. He's on his way. Digging for the plate. The throw. Not in time. Rays win. The Rays with two in the bottom of the 10th inning and beat the Blue Jays 6-5 to five and win the series. High drive to right. Headed to the water, it is out of here! <laughs> and this game is over! I think he hits lefties pretty good. Long drive, and you can forget about this one. Off into the night, headed for San Francisco Bay. This ball game is over, and Yastrzemski. He'd be about the only one left, and I'm not sure he can go. There's a looper into right field. Orioles win it. Pat Vileka with the walk-off base hit, and the Orioles win it in 11. Ah, oh, good that. for that kid. Winning run on third. Hermosillo gets into one. Right field will be deep enough. Reddick's got a big arm. Fife's coming home. Throws up the line. The Angels win it. See Stalin setting up off the corner, and that's gonna do it. Javi Baez with a base hit. Bodie scores. Cubs win. Cubs win 2-1 the final in 11. High fly to deep right center field. Here's what a walk-off winner looks and sounds like in 2020. Field in again, outfield in. First pitch is hit in the air to center. Should be plenty deep. Heineman going back. He's still going back. And that baby's gone. Pescotti with a grand slam. Walk off. And the A's have done it again. How do you like that? On the first pitch that Piscotti sees from Jesse Chavez, he delivers a straightaway center field slam. And just like that, the A's have beaten the Rangers, and the final is 5-1. to one. Didn't get past him like it did John Casey, though. That one up the middle and through. Tucker is in with the tying run. Here comes Reynolds. He will score, and Mr. Walkoff does it again. Kevin Newman is the hero, and the Bucks walk off winners today. 2-2. Two -two. Calhoun down the right field line towards the corner. It's a fair ball. And the Diamondbacks will win the game, and they'll win the series. Their first series win of the year. They come back to win it on a full Calhoun walk off. Five to four Diamondbacks. Let the socially distanced celebration begin. Nick is 0 4 3. Well, it wouldn't it be something if he ended the game with a long ball in his first game back as a starter? Don't put it past him. Fly ball deep toward right field. That ball's going to go. Nick Markakis walks us off on the first pitch. You call it a partner. Driven to right center. Is anybody going to get it? No, they're not, and the A's are going to win the game. Marcus Simeon comes through on the first pitch, drives into the wall in right center, and the Athletics in an unbelievable ball game tonight. 13 innings, they defeat the Houston Astros by a final score of 3-2. to two. And a base hit into right field. Rays are going to win it. Wow scores on the single into right. Michael Perez, it's a 4-3.
Rays victory, and they take three of four from New York. Well, we'll see if that ball four was a big mistake for Hatch. High fly ball. That one's back there, back there, way, Get way back. Here. He did it. Mitch Moreland with a walk-off home run into the monster seats. With two down in the bottom of the ninth inning, and the Red Sox win it five to three. His second home run of the day. Two two on the way. And a swing and a base hit into right field, and they will win it. Travis Shaw drives in Anthony Alford with a winning run, and the Blue Jays are victorious in their first game in Buffalo. Joey, uh, he better get to page 97. <laughs> in the air, straight away center field sends El tag on this unless it leaves a yard. And it's against the wall, and the Reds are going to win the game. On a base hit by Joey Votto, Senzel scores the first walk-off win of the year for the Cincinnati Reds. Tucker sends one high and deep to right field. Got a chance. This ball is gone. Walk it off, Kyle Tucker. His first hit of the series, and the Astros win this game 3-2 on Tucker's second home run of the year. Made the adjustment, got the head out, and now he gets to hang around with the boys at a distance. Straw wears the ice bath from Yuli Gurriel, but a nice swing. And a line drive out to right field. That'll drop in for a hit. Roman Quinn's being waved home. Conforto's throw to the plate. In the air, he is safe. He got his hand in. The Phillies win the ball. Here in the bottom of the ninth inning, a walk-off RBI single by Bryce Harper. And right now, a heck of a slide by Roman Quinn. The celebration is tempered right now because they're going to review it. <laughs> sure. He, he did. did. Fly ball, well hit center. Robles going back to the track, to the wall, and it's gone. Dansby with a walk-off homer in the ninth. hit Diamondbacks walk it off David Peralta the freight train wins it and the Diamondbacks get over 500 they've won five in a row yeah one two Estella hits one out to right field Yastrzemski moving back to the wall that is gone drive home safely Halos win it in a walk off by Tommy Estella. Tommy boy going yard the only pitch he got in that sequence on the inner half, and he lined it out over that yellow stripe for a walk-off for Tommy Boy La Stella. Line drive, base hit. Miles Straw wins the game. The Astros walk it off two to one. They complete a seven and one homestand. Slow roller. Here comes Buxton, and he's safe for the Twins win the game. All right. Here's your new extra inning rule. Machado to deep left field. It is high, deep, and it is a grand slam to walk it off. Manny Machado is tonight's Padres hero. Again, the 3 2 and a chopper into left field for a base hit. Guriel with a bouncer that goes for a single, scoring Hernandez, and the Blue Jays will walk it off in game one. 
Cronenworth up the middle into center field. Around will be Myers. No. Yes, it's kicked in center. Heinemann misplays it, and Myers scores. And the Padres, for the second straight night, have walked it off. And they sweep the Texas Rangers in a four-game series. Wong with a fly ball, and this will do it. A drive into deep right field. Good night. Colton Wong walks it off. Dexter Fowler trotting to the plate. Five to four. The Cardinals win it. And I love the celebration. And a base hit lined into left. That drops in front of Guriel Jr., and the Rays are going to win it. Margot scores, and the Rays win in 10. It's a two to one final. Kiermaier on the first pitch walks it off, and the Rays win in 10. Two outs, and the 2 1 pitch to Duvall. Line drive! Braves win it! Adam Duvall drives home Dansby Swanson, and the Braves have won the game. They've won the series, and they move to 16 and 11 on the year. What a furious final three inning comeback. 2 2. In the air! That will do it! Pedro Severino! A walk-off winner on a Saturday night. And the Orioles snap their losing streak at six. Five, four, and ten. Here's the 1-0. Oh. High fly ball to right. And it sends Hilliard back at the wall. It is gone. And the Dodgers have won it in walk-off fashion. A bullet of a home run just over the glove of Hilliard and right. Cody was sure if that was a home run call or if uh, first base umpire Bill Miller was saying out. Thankfully for Cody, it was the home run signal on the first socially distanced walk-off celebration. This should do it. Yeah. Trout's going to go back. He's going to circle underneath it in deep right center field. Barreto tags. Here comes Barreto, and the A's are going to win it. So Mark Canna keeps it simple, a sacrifice fly, and the A's with their fourth walk-off win of the year, and they take the series over the Angels' final score today, 5-4. to four. So here's Solano. Solano is 0 for 5, 2 and 1. High drive, left field, it is out of here! Donovan Solano sends everybody home, and he will get the hero's welcome. And the Giants have won their seventh straight. That was a big one. And look at the reaction for the Giants bench. And they were down this game, three nothing, six three, and. <laughs> they came back about five different times. 3-1 pitch to Colton Wong. Here it comes. And he walked him, and this game is over. Colton Wong, bases loaded walk. The Cardinals take two of three. They score four in the bottom of the ninth, and they win it six to five. You kidding me with that? Myers to left field. Deep far. Very good. A walk-off home run. This edition of the San Diego Padres is simply unbelievable. The Padres come back down by four runs with two outs in the bottom of the seventh. The game one of a doubleheader, and they walk it off. Will Myers with his eighth home run and the exclamation point. And Rosario clocks one deep left field. Back goes Gardner at the wall. It's out of here! Ahmed Rosario gives the Mets the win with a two-run homer. A walk-off two-run homer for Ahmed Rosario in the bottom of the seventh. And the Mets sweep the doubleheader from the Yankees as they win the nightcap four to three. And he sends a fly ball to center. It is deep. It's gone! 
Randall Gretschik walks it off. And the Blue Jays find a way to win it. Line drive out to yeah. left field. Going back on it is Marcakis. It is gone! A three-run walk-off home run for Scott Kingry. Here in the bottom of the 11th inning, down to two strikes. And he let it rip. Seven for the final score. Celebration 2020 style. Yasmani in the air. Right field, way back, and bring him home! Good night, guaranteed right field. Grandal walks it off, and it's 6 5. The Sox are in first place. Ian Kennedy has always given up a lot of home runs. This one did not last long. We don't have to worry about who's at second base until tomorrow. A towering fly ball. The only question, would it stay fair long enough? And that was answered with a moment of jubilation on the part of the Sox. On August the 28th at the conclusion of the day are in first place in the American League Central. And their ball goes over the head of Ramos. Here comes Frazier, and the Yankees win two to one on a wild pitch. As Kratz squared to bunt, Batances then threw the ball past his catcher, and Frazier scores the winning run, and the Yankees break their seven game losing streak with a two to one victory over the Mets. Ball gets away. Here comes Castellanos to the plate, and the Reds win it. Whoa! Red score two in the seventh to win it six to five. For the Pirates, two one pitch, and there's a fly ball hit back into right field. It's deep. It is gone, and the Brewers win it. Eric Sogard walks it off. Punch, counter punch, and a Sogard haymaker in the night. Well, wasn't a flare to left, was it? <laughs> My goodness, Eric Sogard. A big fly to right. And there it is, base hit left center field. Hits it around third, and the Rockies will win it. Daniel Murphy off the bench. 4-3 Colorado. And the pitch. Lined into right field. Here comes Comforto. He's going to play it on a hop. Here comes Talkman. Here's the throw. Talkman is safe. And the Yankees win 8 to 7. Urshela with the base hit. They've come all the way back and they take an unlikely victory in the first game of a doubleheader. And if they do big things this year, they'll remember this game. Robert in the air. Left field. Gordon back at the track. It is over! The Sox are in first place. Luis Robert sends them there. 5-2 your final score. There's plenty left in that bet, folks. And this was a big one. The slider that didn't slide. And Gordon goes all the way back to the wall. And Gordon looked up, thought he had a chance. But it's Luis Robert who hit it. It's Luis Robert who ended it. What a ball game. And the Sox take two of three. They push the Twins one game back from them and the Indians. The Sox will travel on a happy plane to Minneapolis, tied for first place with the Cleveland Indians because of that man, Luis Robert. The one two, swinging a ground ball, past the dive of Velasquez into left field, a base hit. One run is in. Here comes Grinchik, the throw to the plate. Not in time! Not in time! The Blue Jays win it! A game winning two run base hit by Teoscar Hernandez. The 0 2. And the right center field. Here comes Akiyama, rounding third. Throw to the plate and walk it off, Joey Votto. Told you. Two on pitch. 
That is going to do it. The Dodgers do just enough tonight to win it 3 2 in 10 innings. Fastball that he does hit a fly ball with. He doesn't hit a lot of ground balls. Earlier in the game, I said that, and he hit right into a double play, but not here. Bottom of the tenth inning, here's the pitch. With the bases loaded, he hits it high in the air to center field. Real Muto will tag. Robles is under it. It's not deep. Robles makes the catch. Renuto's going home. Robles is thrown to the plate. Not in time! The Phillies win it on a sacrifice fly by the rookie Alec Baum. They win it 6-5 to five here in the bottom of the tenth inning. A walk-off sack fly. That's driven deep down the left field line toward the stands. It's out of here. Peter Rose wins it with a walk-off two-run homer in the bottom of the tenth. And the Mets yank it out nine to seven. <laughs> One big swing by Pete erases a day of disappointment. His eighth home run of the year. And the Mets win in walk-off fashion, coming from behind twice. The three-two. Shohei pulls one into right field. That's a base hit. Trout is going to be waved around. Drive home safely, everybody. Angels win it 6-5. to five. Oh, Shohei Otani with the walk-off hit. 2-1 pitch. Roping bat roller up the first baseline, and that'll do it. Upton will come in to score. Joe Adele with the walk-off winner. Halos win it 10-9. Oh, what a game for Joe Adele. Hit a home run earlier now. A walk-off. Base hit, two RBIs the other way. He was looking to make contact. Slowly, left side, Buxton flying down the line. He beat it, and the Twins win the game. A four hopper to the shortstop, and Buxton's blazing speed walks off the Tigers. Wow, this is interesting right here. Here it is, game winner. Bingo. Cesar Hernandez singles, Mercado scores, and the Indians have their walk-off win. One, two to Munoz. Swing and a chopper. Try to send a runner home. Wide throw, he's in! And the Red Sox win the ball game. Vasquez got in, the throw is off target, and the Sox win it nine to eight. Here it is. And a fly ball back into center field. That's going to be caught by Marte. No chance. The tag at third. Phillips scores, and the Rays win it in 10. Eric Gonzalez trying for his first ever walk off hit. Sending it out to right. Here comes Tucker. Got it. Offline throw, and the Bucks win it. Eric Gonzalez. Drives in the game winner. Here is Profar, who's grounded out to third, grounded out to second, and last time up, single to center. Profar lines it into right field. That's going to get in and roll towards the corner. Mateo headed for third. Mateo will be waved around by Hoffman. The throw to the plate will be late, and the Padres will walk it off. It's San Diego tonight. Jerks and Profar with a base hit. And oh, watch Jorge Mateo run. Padres win it 1 0. And the pitch coming. And a line drive. Base hit. It's a left field. One run is in. Here comes Dini. The throw to the plate is not in time. The Bills once again come from behind and win it. They do so in the bottom of the seventh inning, and they're jumping all over Alec Boehm. The rookie comes through again. 6-5, the final score in the seventh inning. A little tapper. Martin headed to the plate. And oh, he dropped, he dropped the, ball. the ball. The Buckos win it. Raise the Jolly Roger. Grandal dropped the ball. We'll go ahead and give Newman the walk off again. <laughs> Driven. Left center field. Nobody's going to get it. And that's the ball game as LaStella rounds third and heads home. And Ramon Laureano against his former team. Walks it off, and the A's have taken three of the first four games from the Astros. Alfaro ground ball takes it up the middle. In comes Monte. It's a Marlins win.
<laughs> Michael A. Taylor, and that's a game winner. The Nats get the bat on the ball, and that will do it in 12. They've been doing such a nice job of putting the ball in play with two strikes this year. He's probably frustrated about his bunt attempts the last time. Fly ball center field should be deep enough. Hayward back makes the catch. Yelich tags and this ball game is over. Ryan Braun comes through for the Brewers with a sacrifice fly and the crew takes game one against the Cubs in this huge weekend series. About a postage stamp size where you're looking. Three and one with the bases loaded. High fly ball deep right center field and this one is a walk off grand slam. That'll work as well. Why not? <laughs> Second slam in the last couple of weeks for Blackman. How gratifying is that? Eight for Colorado. Charlie made it. 2-2. Two -two. And this should do it. Going back is Mullins. It's going to be caught. Tagging up is LeMayu. And the Yankees win the game 2-1 to one on the sack fly by Voigt. And the Yanks have won four in a row. In the air, left field, hit pretty well. Get Tyler up. Stevenson, goodbye! Woo! Tyler Stevenson, a walk-off home run. How about the rookies? The stakes are high. Playoffs at stake. Yeah, they're high. Any way you can. Bomber with the 2 2. And there's a shot into left field. And that's caught by O'Neill. Tagging is Garcia. And the Brewers walk off game one. They give up one in the top of the eighth. They score two in the bottom as the Brewers take the opener of this critical series against the Cardinals. Uh, what a snatch and back right there. The Brewers finally able to break that scoreless streak at 21 with a two spot. Whitgren home. Cubs win. Can you believe it? He hits back to back hitters. Cubs win the game six to five. What a crazy way to end a very good ball game. I guess that proves that his intent was not malicious with Contreras. He just had no command of that two seam fastball. So a painful game winning RBI for Cameron Maben. But another big win for the Cubs as they let a lead get away. But all's well that ends well. Cubs win. Cubs win. And time and time again, the two strike breaking ball in the zone is a huge mistake to Javi. The slider way off the plate, maybe a chase. Hernandez to right. See you later. Yadi Yell. And the Nats have walked off the Phillies with two in the eighth. What a time for his first big league home run. And now we dance at home. All right, here we go. Two on, two out, two, two, pitch to Ramirez. Hit in the air, deep right center, angles back. He's out of room, it's out of here. The Indians walk off the White Sox. A stutter here in Cleveland. Jose Ramirez driving the Indians into October. It's a game winner. It's a playoff clincher. And for the fourth time in the last five years, Indians fans, you will have a postseason to remember. A walk-off, three-run homer to right center by Jose Ramirez. The Indians, with four in the tenth, have stopped.
stunned the Chicago White Sox five to three. Uh oh, fly ball to left Stay field. Fair. Near the foul pole. Tommy. And Tommy raised the Jolly Roger. Jacob Stallings clears the deck with a game winning cannonball. His first career walk off home run, and the Bucks defeat the Cubbies. Wow. How about that? Jacob Stallings. You know he was up there looking to do it. He's looking for a pitch to get up the pole. To left field, short left field, down for a hit. Rosario will come around and score, and the Twins walk off the Tigers. A uh, huge stolen base by Eddie Rosario after having a big game tying hit. Then Max Kepler, as we've seen, when he gets hot, look out. A couple home runs recently. There it is, high in the air, deep left field, and the Indians have walked it off again. The second night in a row, a game-winning homer. This time it's Jordan Luplo. And the Indian surge continues late in September. 3-2 is the final. The Indians have taken the first three in this four game series from Chicago. And this one is in the air to right field. It is deep and back goes Duggar at the wall. It's a walk-off win for the Padres in San Francisco. Trent Grisham with a three-run home run. And the Padres walk it off. A 6-5 win. You don't see that every day. San Diego walks it off in San Francisco. Freddie shoots one deep toward left center field. That ball is headed to the track, to the wall, and it's gone! Freddie Freeman walks us off! You said it. That's what MVP moments are made out of. I mean, he had to hit a homer after that video we had with him coming back from break. Just start etching the trophy now. MV free. Freddie Freeman in 11 innings. It's a walk off homer for the Braves. <laughs> Two and one. A little tapper infield. Throw to the play. Wide of the plate. And the Rangers win it in the bottom of the 10th. They didn't have a hit in the inning. They scored two to beat Houston. In the air to right field, it's hit pretty well. Bishop going back, Bishop still <laughs> going back, and that baby is gone. The A's have walked it off in extra innings. <laughs> wow. So the A's down to their final out, but Loriano with the double to tie it, Canna with the home run to win it. And the A's remain perfect in extra innings at 6 and 0. And Kipe, I think it was going to be at least off the wall, ends up getting out of here. Either way, it's a walk off. Jonah Heim had the catching gear on, did not need it. Swing. And the Braves have won it. Who else but Freddie Freeman to deliver the walk off blow? Ball one strike. In the air, center field. Correa's watching. This is back, and it's gone! It's a walk off home run! Carlos Correa! Astros win! Carlos Correa has just forced a game six in this ALCS. What a moment. And the Rays are going to ask for the biggest hit in the life of Brett Phillips. Jansen. That is into center field. Here comes Kiermaier. Phillips has tied the game. Arose Arena coming around. Throw home. Now he stumbles. But the ball gets away. Tampa Bay wins it. Brett Phillips, game four hero. There's your Dan Johnson moment. Oh, my. They're trying to catch him in the outfield, and they can't. That has got to be one of the most unlikely endings to a World Series game in the history of baseball. 
The Rays have won it eight to seven on a base hit by Phillips and a comedy of errors by the Los Angeles Dodgers. And this World Series is tied at two games apiece.